Relief is on the way for children and their parents with organized team sports allowed to resume outdoors soon. And to promote safety, there'll be some changes, and in some cases, even in the way the game is played. Manolo Morales explains. There are two key dates for reopening organized youth sports. On June 19th, kids will be allowed to practice with no more than 30 players. And on July 3rd, they'll be allowed to play actual games with up to 100 people per gathering. I-9 Sports Honolulu says having kids play organized sports again is a much-needed outlet that's been missing for nearly three months. And really compete, you know, that kids are really just waiting to get out there and get, get it back into whatever sport it might be, whether it's flag football or soccer or baseball or, or basketball, not just with our organization, but with any youth organization. The Kenya says the organization has put together safety measures to minimize contact and touch points. In baseball, thumbs up will replace high fives. Kids will be asked to bring their own bats and helmets and not share them. Traditionally, we would, su we would supply a lot of those, those pieces of equipment to our members in order to participate. But, of course, in lieu of everything, we want to make sure that they're safe. Since indoor basketball is not yet allowed, he's looking at playing games outdoors. Kids will be asked to wash their hands before the game, at halftime, and after the game. Kids will also stick to guarding a specific player throughout the whole game. If you're not going to be doing a lot of switching. You're not doing a lot of double teaming. You're really going to kind of stick to your man and your man only, and, and that will kind of limit some of the exposure to some of the other kids out there. Soccer and baseball games can attract more than 100 people with so many families watching, so the Kenya says he'll be asking for only one parent to bring each child to the game. Parents and children will also be asked to wear masks while watching at the sidelines. On Kauai, the mayor has also allowed organized youth sports outdoors effective immediately. Leagues and clubs are required to submit health and safety guidelines, which will be reviewed by the county before issuing a permit. Manola Morales, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii. And good luck keeping one of your parents away from the games.